Welcome to Beefy Storytime. Do you want to read this book with me? Don't forget to click the subscribe button for more. A Mother for Choco by Keiko Kaza. Choco was a little bird who lived all alone. He wished he had a mother, but who could his mother be? One day he set off to find her. First, Choco met Mrs. Giraffe. "Oh, Mrs. Giraffe," he cried, "you are yellow just like me. Are you my mother?" "I'm sorry," sighed Mrs. Giraffe, "but I don't have wings like you." Next, Choco met Mrs. Penguin. "Oh, Mrs. Penguin," he cried, "you have wings just like me. Are you my mother?" "I'm sorry," sighed Mrs. Penguin. But I don't have big round cheeks like you. Then Choco met Mrs. Walrus. Oh, Mrs. Walrus! He cried, "You have big round cheeks just like me. Are you my mother?" Now look, grumped Mrs. Walrus. I don't have striped feet like you, so don't bother me. No matter where Choco searched. He couldn't find a mother who looked just like him. When Choco saw Mrs. Bear picking apples, he knew she couldn't be his mother. Mrs. Bear didn't look like him at all. Choco was so sad he started to cry. "Mommy, mommy, I need a mommy!" Mrs. Bear came running to see what was the matter. As she listened to Choco's story, she sighed. "Oh dear! If you had a mommy, what would she do?" "Oh, I'm sure she would hold me," sobbed Choco. "Like this?" asked Mrs. Bear, and she held Choco very tight. "Yes, and I'm sure she would kiss me too," said Choco. "Like this?" asked Mrs. Bear. And she lifted Choco and gave him a big kiss. Yes, and I'm sure she would sing and dance with me to cheer me up," said Choco. "Like this?" asked Mrs. Bear. And they sang and danced together. When they stopped to rest, Mrs. Bear turned to Choco and said, "Choco, maybe I could be your mother. You?" Choco cried, "But you aren't yellow, and you don't have wings, or big round cheeks, or striped feet like me." My goodness," said Mrs. Bear, "that would make me look very funny." Choco thought it was funny too. "Well," said Mrs. Bear, "my other children are waiting for me at home." Why don't you join us for apple pie, Choco? Apple pies sounded wonderful to Choco, so off they went. When they arrived, Mrs. Bear's other children rushed out to greet her. Choco said, "Mrs. Bear, meet Happy Ally and Piggy. I am their mother too." The sweet smell of apple pie and the sound of laughter soon filled Mrs. Bear's home. After the delicious treat, Mrs. Bear gave all her children a big warm bear hug, and Choco was very happy that his new mother looked just the way she did. Everyone, thank you so much for watching my video. I hope you all enjoyed the story. If you like it, please give a thumbs up or share it, and remember to subscribe so you won't miss any new videos. Have a great day, and see you in my next video.